Adding extra curtain grids and mullions in Architecture Revit 2011. So from the Home tab in the ribbon, we're going to go ahead and select Curtain Grid. We're going to come down to our grid that we've already got placed, and I'm going to grab a, an existing grid that's already going through our curtain wall and notice that it recognizes it and wants to place a horizontal line. Should I want a vertical line, I would grab a horizontal mullion. Today I'm going to work, focus on just doing a horizontal grid. I'm going to do it at center at 6 feet, go ahead and select there, and that's adding in one grid. Now another thing I can do, if you'll notice up here in our modify box, I can do one segment, so I can come in here and just do one at a time, or I can do all segments except what certain ones that were picked. So I can come through here, select that, but then I can come through and select that one. I don't want that one or that one or that one or that one. Thus, one is full segment and accepted segment. Now I can come up and grab my mullions and I can do grid line or grid line segment or all grid lines. Today I'm just going to do grid line segment. We're just going to select these grid lines that I created. Should I do grid line, it's going to grab the whole grid line. And if I had no mullions selected, I would do all grid lines, select that, and it would grab the entire curtain wall, thus creating all of our mullions for us. That is how you do extra curtain grids and mullions in Autodesk Revit Architecture 2011.